May 2nd, June 2nd, 2019. I've taken the past week off of chopping because all the work and effort that goes into running the event at Webster Springs as well as trying to compete at the event at Webster Springs just takes it out of me and uh, I needed to step away from the axe and saw for a little bit. I did get into the gym three times um, and worked about 60 hours because I had to put a lot of stuff on the back burner. So 60 hours in four days. I'm not, I'm not joking. Um, so uh, the aftermath of Webster Springs. Um, very disappointed in the way I cut my standing block in the in the semifinal. That was all on me. I goofed up. Um, just got it was unsettled, uh, but it happens. Um, very pleased with the single. I'm okay with the underhand. I uh, wish I'd have cut a better tree, but so be it. Double buck, pretty good. Thought I jumped the gun. However, on video review, went back and we did not jump the gun. Thank Christ. I was worried that we had. Um, the uh, social media aftermath with a lot of whining from some certain competitors whose names will not be mentioned. Uh, toughen up, buttercups. You know, you, you could find something else to do on Memorial Day weekend if you don't believe in uh, what we're trying to accomplish. So, so be it. You know, if, if you, I, I hate people who are willing to complain but aren't willing to do anything to help us do anything about it. That's, to me, if you're going to only offer um, complaints and problems without being part of the solution, you're a part of the problem. So, yay. It's very frustrating as an event organizer to get those sort of complaints because they're all willing to point out what goes wrong and poke fun at this and poke fun at that, but they're not willing to put in any sweat equity to actually make the event better for everyone. So, toughen up, buttercup. So today, um, I'm going to have to, uh, I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do. I'm not sure exactly. I've got some extra wood left over from Webster. It's all regulation size. I know I want to cut a tree. I know I want to do some stock sawing and hot sawing. And I know that I want to, you know, test some different axes and some drier wood. So I finally got my standing block stand back. So we'll see what happens. Uh, I'm not really positive where I'm going with today, but I will take you along the journey. Getting ready to cut a springboard, as you can see by that beautiful thing that's in the corner of the pocket. I'm going to be using a hardwood trainer. Um, it may take a little bit of time to get this top board in. So, that's that's going fun. into uh, making this top board hole, it's going to be difficult. So, what I want to try and do is just be sure of it and um, put a good one in, like I know I can. I'm old, should be able to. event 
commentary in addition to pre-event commentary. So uh, post-event on that springboard, I'm still a bitch. Still a bitch. Got to gotta grow some balls and get back on the board. Just going to take trees. So be it. Next uh, log is a full 38-inch um, white pine. It's a turned log that was left over from the Webster Springs handicap block. So it's a dry log. Um, and I'm using an axe I want to try. Uh, no plans, no expectations. We'll see what happens on this. Uh, if I have a goal, if I can cut this under 20 hits, I think I'm doing well because I think it's dry, but we'll see. log is a full lathe turn 41 inch white pine this is one of the leftover championship blocks from webster springs uh testing an axe in it um no expectations uh however i will note that it took i think i think the slowest qualifier at webster was 27 seconds so we shall see Whoever didn't cut block number six needs your ass kicked because that thing was a piece of butter. Man, I think I cut it in like 18 seconds. But, you know, the I could have cut it a lot faster. I mean, I cut it right off. I mean, drove nothing in the top wood and barely drove any wood on the bottom. So there's a lot of hits that could have been saved there. And it was 22 hits and it was my ch chippy fast hits with two sticks. My best Homer Simpson and go up a tree during a lightning storm. Yep. I'm waiting for the lightning storm to stop so I can go outside and stock saw on hot saw. It's pouring rain down here. I'm going to race a, another foot log. This is a leftover master's underhand log. Um, again, full 38 inches. I want to use a different axe. See what happens.
is another one of the leftover 13-inch uh, championship logs from Webster. Um, this one's not as good as the last one. I'm pretty sure of that. Um, so this one's going to take some thumping. If I can cut this one under the 26 seconds, I think I'm doing pretty well. But uh, we shall see.